Hey what's up guys, today Sony announced its latest gaming console the PlayStation 4. The PS4 will be based on a supercharged PC architect with an x86 processor, enhanced PC style GPU, and 8 gigabytes of GDDR5 unified high speed memory. The controller for the PS4 will be called the DualShock 4 and feature the Vita style touchpad, a light bar on the back to identify players and each PS4 will contain a 3D camera to track the various controllers using the bar. The PS4 will let users suspend and resume play just by pressing the power button getting rid of long boot times. The console also contains a secondary chip that is designed just to manage uploads and downloads even if the power is off and digital titles will be playable as they are being downloaded. The PS4 also has an always on video compression that will allow users to upload video as they go and letting gamers share footage or photos of their gaming much easier than before. The PlayStation 4 will now allow users to watch games being played by others and being able to reach out and play on a friend's system. Owners will also be able to use their smartphones and other personal devices to browse videos and use companion apps. Sony will also let developers implement second screen functionality that will let gamers play PS4 titles on their Vita. The one downside of the PlayStation 4 so far is that it won't be backward compatible with PS3 games straight out the box, but Sony did say it is exploring advanced technologies to bring PS3 support to the PS4 eventually. Sony has completely overhauled the user interface on the PlayStation 4. The interface relies heavily on social and video features with mobile companion mobile apps that look almost identical to the PS4 UI and some of the games that Sony announced to be coming alongside of this console are Killzone, Shadow, Fall, Drive Club, which is a team-based racing game in Infamous Second Son. No pricing or pictures of the console was shown today, but they did say it would be released this holiday season. Okay guys, that's pretty much it for this video. Please leave a comment below about what you think about this console so far. And don't forget to like and subscribe if you're not already. Okay guys, hope to see you in the next one. Alright, bye.